Welcome back to Character Select. We just unlocked a missile with precision bomb jumping. Precision bomb jumping, people. Oh, Grab come on, fucking... just walk Jesus. into it. Ugh. Oh. Uh, Ooh, I chose a lore entry. The future is a vague thing, ever-changing and always in doubt. Even if we chose what could gain the ability to foresee the future, it would be a hollow gift, for we could never hope to control what is yet to occur. The fountain is an example of this. The day may come when its water dries up and there is nothing we can do to stop such a tragedy. But we do know this. Unlike the uncertain flow of water, the power of our will is strong and enduring. The will of the Chozo will never run dry. Are, they, are you um, sure about that? You're all dead. Your you're... will is kind of gone. Okay. So we don't need to go through that door yet. That oh. just goes back to where we were. Oh, well, okay. I didn't then. want to get that missile pack. because More missiles, missiles. more fun. I mean, you may as well get also, them now. Also, the music in this game is pretty freaking awesome. Well, yeah, their sound design was fantastic. It's amazing. The, the music is one of the most memorable, memorable parts of the game. Where does that door go? It goes that way. Transport access north oh, to the, the hive, hive totem. totem. That was where we got the missile launcher. Okay. So there's actually more places to go here, but we can't actually get into them yet. So. Yeah. Do, 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 do. It's time to go to the Magmore Caverns. Into the Magmore. Yay. Into the hot plate, the hot zone. Which has a remix of a song from Metroid uh, Super Metroid. Also, now that we have the various suit, our boots have cool knee spikes. Knee just spikes. Just in case we need to knee somebody in the groin. And fatally. Kill. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, is there anything in here? Nope. Okay. Pew. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay. So. Sorry. What? Fucking shriek pets. They're everywhere. So this song is basically a slower paced version mm -hmm. of Ridley's uh, Lair from Super Metroid. Oh, really? You sp yep. You speed it up and it's the same song. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Dun, 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 I think it's how it goes. We will hear hey, soon enough. It. I don't even know if those are unique shriek bats. Sometimes they are. Nope, they're just normal shriek bats. Pop, 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 pop. And there's hey, that look, thing. Hey, look, it's a Grisby. Carapace can be breached by missiles, so let's fucking do that. I wonder, is Samus the one naming all of these creatures as she finds them? I think they were named by the Chozo. But how would Samus oh, know that? Because her... Her How would her suit Chozo know tech. that? Her suit is Chozo Tech. What do you want? I like to think that Samus is just naming these things as she finds them. Well, she's really bad at naming because she named this thing a burrower. Well, what else would you fucking call it? A dingledang? It's a terrible name. Meg, more caverns. Yeah, here's the song. Hey, look, it's a lava snake. It's a magmore. A magmore. The they have a keen sense of smell somehow. For being creatures that survive in liquid lo liquid rock. Mm -hmm. That is a puffer. We'll rupture on contact with lethal metavibrium gas. Float about in search of food. If ruptured, the gas within the puffer is violently released. Everything on Talon 4 explodes. <laughs> Despite their fragile bodies, they are aggressive predators. Which seems counterproductive. Yep. So they basically say, if you kill me, I'm, I'm taking you. you down with me. If you don't kill me, I'm going to eat you. Basically. What a bunch of dicks. As most things on this planet are. That's not mm -hmm. that. Well, that, that shows a lore entry kind of explained it. The things that... The peaceful creatures that weren't super predatory. 
Turned into it's, horrible uh, monsters. Turned into super predatory monsters. That are not so. generally very good at living. Yep. What are you? I don't remember this. They're buggos. They are triclopses. They're triclopses because they have three thinchers. They have three pointy bits. Okay, so we can't go up. So we gotta go under. Yep. Watch out for them. Don't let them touch you. See? Eh. And they spit you out. Fuckers. That's all they do. They hurt you a little bit and they spit on you. And you can't... And then they go for bombs and explode. Yep. Because eh. they're dumb. Eh. 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 Can't do anything. No, I can, you can shake out. Oh, you can. That's what I just did. Also, I love that I'm destroying the local ecosystem because it's in my way more than anything. Well, the ecosystem is kind of doomed anyway, so it doesn't really matter. It's true. We haven't even seen what the great poison is. Nope, nothing. <sighs> this steam is hot. It is very hot. It's volcanic gas. It's also poisonous. It's a good thing I'm in a fully encased suit then. Uh, yeah, it is. Pew, pew, pew. Um, I don't think there's anything in here worth scanning, but... Also, you wanted me to scan hmm? the boxes, but I can't. Yeah, I thought you could. So, I think you told me to do that like four or five episodes it was a long ago, time so... Ago. It was a long time ago. Oh god, these platforms are falling! Oh, ah! Oh, ah! This... I'm, you de your various suit, while amazing at getting rid of heat, cannot save you from lava. Don't get in the lava. Okay. Gravity suit can save me from lava. No, it can't. It does not. Yes, it can. It still hurts you. No. Doesn't it? Uh, I don't know if it's true in this Pretty game, but sure in uh, Super you. Metroid, when the gravity suit was first introduced, you literally were like, lava? And just I'm start diving into it. Pretty sure those are gun turrets. Look out for them. I am pretty sure that the gravity suit only makes it so you are lighter in water. Pretty no, sure. No, every, every suit increases your defensive capability. Well, I mean that too. Well, I'm pretty sure you still get hurt by lava. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's lava. It is lava. Quite frankly, that makes more sense. Um, I think I can climb the tower, but I don't want to yet. Hmm. I think it's better to go through this door. Maybe. Could Ooh. be. Struct fractures in Bendesium frame. Guess what we need to pop that in? Bendesium. Maybe. Super missiles? Nope. Well, I don't remember. Power bombs. Oh, well, those are a little ways away. Oh, yeah. But see, that's what I like about Metroidvania games. It's like, there's no way I can interact with that yet. Nope. But I will be able to soon, and I'll just have to remember to come back here and do just that. Yep. It's stuff like that, like, that's just... It's interesting to me. It makes the game feel like it's not... Okay, so I guess the best analogy I can think of is, you, you know RPGs, right? Well, yes. Like JRPGs? Yes. First town that you start off in, always surrounded by the weakest enemies in the game. Yes. And has the shittiest equipment. Yes. This game is like the antithesis of the JRPG. It basically mm -hmm. says, hey, you need stuff in order to get through here, but uh, you don't have that stuff, so you're going to have to go find it and come back. Mm-hmm. And well, I, it's I, an exploring. Like it's that. like an, it, 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 there's a big chunk of these games that are just about exploring. Yeah. Talon over World West. Kind of go out of this hot place and go into the cool jungle place again. I don't know if this is where I want to go. I think it is. It but... might be where you want to go. Ugh. Concealed loading times. Yep. Do do do. Anything in here? Mm, uh, nope. Okay. Pew, pew. Doo, doo, doo. Go away. Spiky. Hey, guess what? What? Missiles. Ah. It's, the, it's the only missile expansion I explicitly remember. That because one. Because I always wondered, what's the point of the steam coming from underground? Where is it coming from? 
So I was like, I'm going to jump off this bridge. And then I landed and I was like, oh, it's literally like four feet down. It's just okay. to hide you. It's just, to hi <laughs> it's just to hide the missiles. Oh, it's this big room. Uh, beetles! More bugs. But yeah, games that games that force you to like to this game hasn't even given us our main. Well, no, not backtrack because backtracking implies that you miss something. Hmm. But um, games that give you a specific objective and then let you loose in basically a huge open world that you can explore if you can figure out how, but you don't necessarily have all the equipment to figure out how yet. Mm -hmm. That's the kind of thing that I like. And I don't necessarily know why, but I guess it feels... I guess I feel like it gives you autonomy. Hmm. Well, yeah. Which, you I mean, it's cool. cannot go any Let's... further. Gotta go that way. <laughs> Boom, fucker. Stupid idiot. Oh, you've been um, in this room before, I think. Yep. Oh, yeah, but yeah, yeah game... Like, and I definitely don't like all Metroidvania games because they are not all the same. No, they do um, not all have the same quality. Some yeah. are definitely better than others. Like, um, honestly, Metroid Fusion is probably my least favorite Metroid, specifically because they do away with a lot of the open worldness of it and hmm. or the open world feeling and tell you you need to go to X and do Y. It is a very like, well, objective based. I... Yeah, it's like, well, what if I don't want to do that? Uh, yeah, we need to go back here. Okay, yeah, go back to the landing site. Ow. I don't care. You have that big bug. Also, you know what? What uh, you know what thing in the uh, what the best weapon in this game is? Best normal weapon that doesn't require ammo. The plasma gun. Plasma gun. <laughs> Shoots faster than the power beam. Does more damage than the power beam. Sets guys on fire. Yep. Wait, what the fuck? Did I miss something? I did. There was. But I need the boost ball for that. No, I don't. I can't. Maybe be right. you can just All climb. Right, but. <sighs> God damn it. Fucking beetles! I don't care. Better watch out. They'll gonna poke you. Well, they failed singularly at po poking me. Also, the um, the it, we didn't we're not looking at our equipment screen to find this shit out, but getting the uh, the various suit did increase our defense, so enemies do less damage to us now. So that's good times. Just keep going. But, it's like the door's like but, right there. Yeah, that's no, the, the door that we came door. out of. Yeah, right, that's it. Yeah, that's where we... You need to get up there. You can't be right. Yeah, you need the boost ball. Maybe you have to go back you... to the magma caverns. We can always just wait for hints to give us the hint. Oh, you mean for the map to say, hey, fuck Lord. Yep. This is all of our items, by the way. Options. Item acquired, 14%. Um, it's under display. It? HUD lag, no. Hint system. We can only turn it on. It's already on. It will only do things sometimes. Because hmm. I can see the... Go to... Oh, the... no. You know what I need to do? Mm -hmm. uh, I know what I need mm -hmm. to do. Yeah. Ah. Gotta go back to the landing site. Ah. This isn't strictly required, but it's important for the ah. progression. Well, that's good. I don't think it gives you anything. Do, do, do. I'm pretty sure there's some stuff under that waterfall. Over here? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure. There's some stuff around here. Fish. There's some stuff. I mean, there, I know there's stuff in this room. Uh, I don't it's, disagree. It's under stuff. Under some things. It's a fern. It's non-toxic. Delightful non-toxic ferns. <laughs> I prefer my ferns non-toxic. How about you? Yeah, I mean, yeah. I like to not get stung by plants. <laughs> God damn it. Two, two, two. You think there's something? Uh, wait, maybe? Oh, it's, 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 it's orange. It's that. 
It's a morph ball hole. Oh. And it gets us over here, which is not helpful. Right in the caves. This le- There's a door, though. You haven't never, never gone in here. Yeah, this this leads to the wrong place, though. Fucking mushrooms. It's the mushrooms. I'm gonna like mushrooms on my pizza. You don't like mushrooms on your pizza? What kind of... What, what are you? Can't even go that way. Uh... It's way up oh, there. Oh, wait. It's behind that rock. Small opening near the floor. Oh. Oh, what? look at that. Okay. Achoo. Oh, and look who... What? Look at who it is. It's Flying pirates. Guys. Pirates trained and equipped for airborne assault. They're extremely agile in the air, but the heat signatures of their therm- jetpacks can be tracked with thermal imaging. While their missiles are extremely potent, their jetpacks are- can be even more so. If the pack fails, they'll make a suicide strike. Because everything in fucking Talon 4 explodes. Ever, ever. Oh, nope, they're just gone. And what's that? Oh, what's this that? This appears to be the same type of container found in the Space Pirate Research Frigate. Material seeping out of the ruptured metal is highly toxic. Analysis indicates that this may be the phazon compound the space pirates were using in their biological experiments. For the record, the space goo. hurts like shit. It's very toxic, Dave. Incredibly toxic. It's also extremely radioactive. Mm-hmm. Can't go that way. You need things. So, uh, for anybody that's curious, the frigate we were on crashed. It's right that's there. it over there. It's yeah, all it, right uh, there. it hit the planet quite badly. Quite badly. But I feel like. There's a thing underwater, but I don't want to go after it. So Maybe. Fuck it. There might be. We something. come back here much later when before we actually get the gravity suit. You need the grapple beam. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Because okay, so here's the thing. That door right there, I know for a fact... No, wait, sorry. That door up there, I know for a fact, leads Uh, to the space jump, which lets us jump twice. Yeah. Uh, It's basically our double jump. And I know for the fact that it's what we need in order to progress through Magmore Caverns. Uh But I don't remember how to get it, so we're just going to kind of fuck around here. You've never been up on this this rock before. Oh, this leads to... You've never gone this way. Oh, look, you're up above. Mm. Hey, look, a door. Yeah, You've never been door. here before. Oh, what's Oop, this? It's a thing. Oh, look at those guys. They spit stuff at they you. They are seedlings. Nobody cares. Oh, you're so slow. This is optional. You don't need to do this. Well, you're going here. Impact and... crater. And there's just this giant rock suspended directly above it. Mm-hmm. Blocking the IR sensor with my knee. Hey, scan oh, that. I gotta thing. actually scan that. Pirate data. Space pirate encrypted data decoded. Field team reports are in on the aged structure of alien design built on the surface of Talon 4. Studies show this structure projects a containment field. This field bars access to a prime source of energy within a deep crater. Science team believes the field is powered by a number of strange Chozo artifacts. We have found some of these relics and studies on them have begun. As this field could hinder future energy production operations on Talon 4, we must dismantle it as soon as possible. This means the destruction of the Chozo artifacts. It will be done. Uh, if everything. anybody destroys Chozo artifacts, the Chozo get pissed. Oh, yeah, they get real mad. They like those also, things. Also, they're all dead. So, you know. They can't really stop you if they're dead. Yep, there's a door. Oh, oh, that's, oh, that's a good one. Poorly concealed loading times. That was a strong one. Throughout our living nightmare, as we battle with this unyielding darkness, we chose to see a light. This light glows with promise, chasing the shadows cast by the great poison and purifying that which has grown toxic. It is strange, though. At times, it looks to our eyes as if the light coalesces into the figure of a woman. Burning brightly, the luminescence descends from space and then retreats back into the infinite blackness from whence it came. When this prophecy comes to pass, when the light recedes, the Chozo's long vigil- vigilance of containment will finally come to an end. Could they be talking about Samus? Oh, I don't know. Also, you know you're going in the right direction because the lore is exactly the ones you want. Is the next pieces in the book. The containment of the great poison. This task has fallen to the Chozo and we will not flee from our duty, even as we suffer with the land and its creatures. We will pour our will into the Twelve, the artifacts that 
when brought together, form the lock that holds this great evil at bay in the depths of the planet. This lock must stand up to all who might come to assault it. To preserve the power of the seal and to protect it from those who would meddle for their own designs, we will spread the artifacts across the land, hiding them from prying eyes. The lock must never open until the day comes when this disaster can finally be put right. So now, even though it's never explicitly stated, we have our mission. That That's mission right there, is to collect the 12, bit, 12 MacGuffins and bring them right back here. And there's one right mm -hmm. there. It's a little blocky thing. Then scan the totems here for clues and locations of the remaining artifacts. Together, the artifacts will open a path to the center of the impact crater. So the Chozo were hit by a giant meteor that was poisoning the land. They realized that it was poisoning the land, that they needed to contain it, because they couldn't destroy it. Um, yay, cool. Uh, artifact of so truth. we have to finish what they started. It is our duty. Not least of all because the space pirates want what's in the impact crater and the Chozo were rightly afraid of it. Artifact acquired. So. Scan those pillars! Why? Because they tell you I where know stuff where the, I know where the Shh. fucking shit is. Don't be a bitch, Dave. See? That was a fucking a research a right yours. there. You need them. Fine. I'm not going to read this shit. See? They're all important. They are all read. Artifact. Artifact. Artifact! Jesus. You're so fucking demanding. I am. That's the one you got. Artifact is truth has been returned. Yay, got that one already. Da -da -da. Recording to logbook. Recording to logbook. Hmm. That's weird. Sure, yeah, I think that's here. all of them. Interesting. Uh, still don't have a space jump, though. Nope. God damn it. You're so, yeah, th I don't know where it is, but there's something here that if you scan it, it says, Woe befall those who would destroy the Chozo artifacts or Chozo statues or something like hmm. that. I don't think I've ever encountered what? that. Which seems like foreshadowing, but I don't know where it is, so whatever. Stop trying to kill me. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Thank you. Alright, so that's All the right. temple. Yep. And that gives us our mission at last. Mm hmm. And also tells us why the pirates are here. It does, that it does. And uh, next time on Character Select, I'm gonna get some goddamn space boots. We're gonna get those boots one day. Ooh, what's oh, what's that? That's a little cave. Ooh. That's missiles! Yay! So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. And Kanathis. Yes? How do I get the space jump? I want space boots. We'll find the boots next time on Character Slot. Maybe. Alright then. Maybe. <laughs> Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's not promise things we can't necessarily do.